Hey guys, what's up? It's Cece. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see, I'm starting off this hot puff tutorial with saturated hair. I'm basically using a spray bottle filled with water, my Aussie leave-in conditioner, as well as coconut oil, and I saturate my hair. Basically, I spray the water because if I have any leftover gel from any of the previous days that I've been doing my hair, I kind of use that spray bottle to soften it up, and then I pack it again with more gel. Makes sense, right? No, not really, but that's what I do. As you guys can see, I'm basically using that gel to help define my curls and stretch them as well. I know people don't recommend heat, but I like to sit under dryer to get my hair halfway dry. And then I'm going to get into the extra tutorial in the next clip to show you guys how I get my puff. So for this video, I'm just going to show you guys how I achieve my puff. I literally use, let me not even count how many things I use because I do use quite a few items. Two things of edge control. I'll tell you why I use each of these. Brush for my edges, which is dirty as hell, but that's fine because it's my hair. And then a hard brush. My Cantu, uh, what is this? Comeback Curl Next Day Curl Revitalizer for natural hair. It refreshes curls and reduces frizz all while adding shine. So I use that on my hair as well. If you guys see me looking down, it's because I'm looking at the mirror, but I started wearing my hair out like, mm, I don't know, maybe like a month or two ago, probably three actually. Um, I don't know what made me decide to start wearing it out, but I did. And I kind of just started watching YouTube videos on how to define, you know, my curl pattern and make the most of my hair. The reason I have two different edge tamers, I love Evens. Evens is something that I swear by. I keep telling myself, well, I've been telling myself literally since December that I was going to do a, a favorites video for the month. And somehow when it comes time for me to film it, I'm just lazy and I don't do it. So, yeah, that's what I use whenever, like, I'm, um... If I'm, why do I say, um, I really need to work on my public speaking because I really be talking to this camera like people aren't going to be watching this video. And I know some people are like, oh my gosh, she sounds so damn uneducated. All she says is, um, all she says is like, but you know, whatever. You get my point. That's all that matters to me. So with this first set of edge control that I'm using, it is the Evens Braiding Edge Tamer. And it's supposed to be 48 hour um, edge control. Let me just tell you guys, this does not work for my edges, like to hold it at all. Like it just doesn't. I use this if I'm like braiding my hair and I want that really slick and defined look, then that's what I use it for. I use that more so to get my hair in a uniform texture like I'm gonna see if I zoom in if you guys can kind of see like the appearance that it gives me let me just you see how like that just it gives you that sleek just slick look whenever and then for my edge control I use this evens edge control um it's a 24 hour extreme firm hold edge tamer of course that's not how it was read on the box but you know get the point this is the one that i use whenever you know you guys see my pictures on instagram or whatever social media platform you follow me on and you see my edges looking late to the gods that's because this is the only edge control that i use i found out about this edge control from my cousin kayla she does hair here in columbia i'll leave her information down below in the drop down box so if you guys are looking for somebody who does like really great sew-ins and can really help your hair grow in the Columbia area, I'll definitely be sure um, that I leave, I'll definitely be sure to make sure that I leave her information down in the bottom bar below with a description box below along with everything else and the products that I was using. Now, I'm not sure if Evans has a website, but when I tell you if you are a natural girl, or even, hell, even if you're not, Evens is so bomb. Like, I just don't know what I was doing with my life before I found out about this edge control. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to, like, you know, get my edges the way that I want them. But y'all see how, like, how slick my edges are getting from this edge control? That's all I do is put this curl revitalizer on it. I put the, um, the sleek edge control is what I call it on there and then I use this one and I 
go on about my day and my hair stays like this literally all day like sometimes I can wake up in the morning and not have to redo my edges because they're still intact from you know how I did it the day before so get y'all some evens this is my literally my second tube of it and it comes like in little travel sizes now so if you're not sure how it's going to react to your hair but you still want to try it out most stores do have like the little I call them the little bite size travel um edge tamers that you can try and you know test it out and let me just rave about this by the way this is not a sponsor video i say this all the time i do not have enough subscribers for anybody to be paying me to talk about their product and i'm not gonna get on here and show y'all something that i do not swear by something that i do not like because i don't want it you know i mean i guess everybody's different and certain stuff is gonna work you know however for certain people but i don't want y'all to go out and spend your hard-earned money on something and be like oh cc mentioned it in the video and talked about it like it was the best thing ever and it sucked so this works for me the way that i was originally doing it, i was stretching it out folding it over and then pushing it up but i just find i get so much volume so much more volume it makes my puff look a lot bigger when i use the cut one so yeah that's what i'm gonna do so basically um with the evens edge control i just feel like it's it's the best edge control i have ever used in my entire life i'm sorry guys oh let me show y'all what i'm doing in the back so you see how level it is at the back i do less to the front more manipulation in the back so that way my puff looks a lot higher if that makes sense um and then i just take it and I go back around. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this because this hairband is black and my hair is black. So if it's not clear in the video, I guess I can find a way uh, to show you guys a more clear um, quality of how to, you know, tie them. But yeah, that's how I do my puff. And obviously, you know, I bunch it together so you can't tell or anything starts to separate. And then that's where this curl revitalizer comes in. Again, in me using the gel that I have over here to help um, define the curl. The puff is done. If y'all need a more detailed video, then obviously, you know, I'll give y'all that. But let me go ahead and play with my edges while I, um, you know finish up this chit chat i've tried the murray's edge wax i've tried um i've tried murray's edge wax i've tried what else the shekinah gel stuff does work for me like i've tried that i've tried oh the cream of nature all these different edge controls and none of them hold my edges throughout the day like by the end of the day my edges are rolling up they're not still in place they look a mess and that's embarrassing what i look for in an edge control is extreme hold and this is the first time that i've purchased an edge control that says that it's you know an extreme hold and it's actually been an extreme hold and i don't have to worry about if my edges are going to be in place by the end of the day i'm going to show you guys exactly what my edges look like at the end of the day from using this evens edge control so yeah that's pretty much all i all i do to my hair and i just want to say because i'm not somebody that's extremely you know an expertise in natural hair you know what they call them the natural hair nazis that's not my thing like it's just not i don't know <laughs> I don't know a lot about natural hair, natural hair types or anything like that. So I kind of just stay in my lane and do what works for my hair. And I will say, don't be bamboozled by all these people that you see using all these expensive ass products. Yeah, it may work great for their hair, but you need to figure out what your hair likes and what your hair needs by doing trial and error. And I'm treating like my natural hair journey the same way that I treated my makeup journey. I'm not going to go to all these high-end places and purchase all this expensive product and i don't know how it's going to react to my hair because what if i spend all this money on it and a i can't return it or my hair doesn't like it then i've wasted my money and don't forget to thumbs up my video i will leave all of my social media information down in the description bar below don't forget to follow me on instagram follow me if you can find my real twitter Follow me on Twitter because that's usually the most active at. And Snapchat, I've kind of gotten into this thing where I don't really snap as much, but I watch people snap because I feel like I'm boring. Like, what y'all want me to do? Go on there and rant all day? So, I don't really use Snapchat as much as I use. 
If you guys have any questions or any suggestions or any products that you think that I should try that are not $100 for it to do the literally the same exact thing that all those products are going to do that I showed you, let me know and I will go pick those up and I will test them out and see how I like them and obviously film the response. So yeah, I love you guys and I will see you all in my next video. So hey guys, I absolutely fell asleep on y'all last night, not even gonna lie, I got in bed, I tied my hair up, and as soon as I got comfortable, I was like, shit, I forgot to film the update for this edge tamer, but luckily, when I got in the bed, I literally just tied my hair up, so my hair still looks the exact same under here, so, let's see. And I just got up too, so sorry if my voice sounds weird, but these are my edges. Y'all y'all see what I mean? Like now do y'all kind of understand why I was ranting and raving? Like even if I touch my hair, it's not going nowhere. It's just, it's not going anywhere. This shit. It's the truth. I believe this one was $5.99. You should be able to find these at your local beauty store. If not, like a good neighbor, Amazon is there. And yeah, that's it for this video. I hope to see you guys in my next one. I love you guys and toodaloo.